You cannot personally supervise your network 24 hours a day. Log files provide a record of activity which can help you to understand what took place in the past. This will allow you to detect threats and respond to security concerns. You can identify issues before they become problems. iOS provides valuable logging functionality for day-to-day -day use. This can be enhanced by additional application software for short-term forensic analysis or long-term event correlation. Anyone who has ever tried to deduce meaningful information from a set of log files which have uncoordinated times and even dates will tell you that it's an uphill struggle. But all managed switches have a time client and most have a time server. Typically, Network Time Protocol or NTP is used by firewalls and Simple Network Time Protocol or SNTP is used by switches. Many industrial Ethernet switches offer other more accurate time protocols, but these are not required for general operation. Typically, a time server will obtain the precise time from satellites. But log files do not require precise time. In fact, they do not even require the correct time. They just require synchronized time. Accountability is a major component of network security. In other words, who did what and when. This information is so vital that regulatory authorities often insist that documentary evidence is available. Switches use volatile memory to store events, so information is lost after a power cycle. External media can be used to store data persistently, but external memory media can be stolen or its data can be erased. This method of data storage is just not persistent enough. The audit trail is truly permanent. The data cannot be deleted. It's stored in memory located inside the switch which cannot be accessed. It meets the criteria for regulatory compliance. But please take note, if you borrow a switch for evaluation, bear in mind that the audit trail contains sensitive information which you cannot erase. Syslog is an abbreviation for System Logging Protocol. It's used by network devices to send system messages to a centralized log server. The messages can be used for system-wide analysis. Syslog is a universal solution which has been in use for decades. Syslog messages can contain sensitive information about a network which would be valuable to an attacker. Like other older protocols, it was never designed with security in mind, and its messages are sent in plain text. Today, syslog messages must be encrypted. Today's network management applications offer a wide range of security functionality. This is often specific to a hardware manufacturer. Fine-tuning the security functionality of your network infrastructure can be a time-consuming process, and it's easy to overlook some parameters, giving an entry path to an attacker. Network management software should provide a graphical overview of the security status of a network. Going one step further, you need the option to lock down your network with just a couple of clicks. The unauthorized connection of rogue devices is a major security risk. Your network management software will notify you and prompt for a response. If attackers can get access into your network devices, they will almost certainly change the configuration. 
For example, they will add their own login account to facilitate future attacks. Network management software can keep you aware of many potentially threatening scenarios. Although not strictly a security function, network administrators often ask about the relationship between syslog servers and network management systems. In terms of event handling, syslog servers typically have a huge amount of data storage, which means that events can be recorded and analyzed over a long period of time. Syslog applications use a technique called event correlation. This involves analyzing the relationship between events and then creating alarms based on user-defined rules. Network management systems usually save events over a short period, which make them ideal for highlighting information about what happened in the last day or two. Changes in network traffic patterns are a good indicator that something is amiss on your network. New devices appear. Devices which have never talked to each other before start communicating. Traffic loads increase. These are typical symptoms that you need to be aware of. Switches offer two methods of centrally collecting and analyzing data from remote parts of a network. SFlow randomly samples data packets and sends the samples to a central SFlow collector for analysis. Random samples are normally enough to detect irregular network activity. Remote Switch Port Analyzer, known as RSpan, allows data from a remote switch to be copied across the network to a local destination port. As every packet is copied, this makes RSpan an excellent tool to be used in conjunction with intrusion detection systems.